Bonjour everyone, we're still in Gatwick, waiting to board. We're in Carrefour. Nous sommes en Carrefour. And obviously the search for oat milk <gasps> begins. Bro, do they have not oat milk? I think this is oat. It looks like. Yeah. I think this is tea is it oat? Yes, I think sponges. The girlies got the goods. Baguette is secured. We passed by the front door to the flight and then. Rien. So we had to call like random flats. And I just perdu le ciel pour la porte. Because there's two staircases, so. But we have groceries, we're close. We'll keep you updated. Bisou! Girl, girl. Sorry, I'm being so obnoxious, but. Girl, it's so cute. Look out, look out. Miss Housewife is getting our ingredients <laughs> together. Baguette, brie, hummus, cream cheese with herbs. I'm not eating quick. <laughs> <laughs> If you guys know, I thought this was a rat for a second. I'm just so scared they're gonna come for me. Our water has boiled. <gasps> ah! I forgot it's plugged in. <laughs> Why is this chip so chaotic already? I can't multitask. C'est le temps pour faire un café. Hi guys, welcome to Vlog in Paris. I'm gonna show you a little apartment tour. I think apartment is a bit of a an overstatement about this space, but it's a really cute room studio. We have our lovely bed, double. This cute little corner and shelf. All of our belongings. I really like this hanger situation. We have the main piece, which is the window, and I adore it, and I'm sorry to be a walking cliche, but can you be upset about this view in the morning? Here's our little bathroom slash kitchen situation. This is so funny to me. The bathroom is on the corridor, so we're like sharing it. There's nothing separating the shower from the rest of the room, so it's just vibing there. But I really like this. I really like the tiles, first of all. We're here for three full days, and like on the fourth day, we're leaving like late. We have time, which is nice because I feel like it's a city you don't want to rush. And I was saying how I feel like it's the city where you cannot avoid being the cliche obnoxious tourist. You, you just can't. This is the worst shot ever. Cheers. A wearing mini skirt, scarf top, play that. We had breakfast, we were watching Eva Melosha's vlog. And then, yeah, we're gonna get croissant. I look so, I feel like so fancy. I, I should wear it down a little bit. No, no, I love it. Nous sommes très heureux. Did I wear a bit of your perfume? Bien sûr. Mademoiselle. Bisous, I'll talk to you later. It's closed. Oh, and it won. Boulangerie de la Nez. Where's my croissant? Taste that. It's a really good croissant. Mm, it's so like buttery, you know. One reason for which my Paris trip was so much fun is that I finally got to use my French firsthand, even if the out of class setting made me sometimes stumble over my words. But hey ho, language learning is all about essay et erreur. What helped me build my speaking confidence beforehand were the French classes I attended, thanks to the courtesy of Wingoda, the sponsor of today's video. Lingoda is an online language learning school offering classes in a few different languages with certified native level teachers. One of the best things about Lingoda is that, unlike face-to-face -face classes, you can take control over your learning and adjust it to your schedule. Classes are available 24-7 and when booking, you get to choose from a wide variety of times, topics and proficiency levels. 
An additional bonus is the small class size of only up to five students, ensuring that everyone gets a chance to participate without feeling anxious about speaking a foreign language in front of 30 strangers. If you're feeling up for the challenge and want to immerse yourself in your chosen language, Lingoda is currently offering you two versions of their usual learning challenge. The sprint, where you attend 15 classes per month for two months and upon completion receive either a 50% cashback or you can choose to get rewarded with 40 additional class credits, as well as the super sprint, following the same rules except with twice as many classes, so 30 per month for two months, and the potential reward of 75 class credits upon completion. If you want to track your progress in the challenge, you can use Lingoda's sprint tracker after each completed class. Y'all know I'm a Virgo and this kind of stuff gets me way too excited, plus it's just rewarding to see how far you've come. To give you an additional boost of motivation, you can save some money by using my code VERONICA, which will give you either 20 euro or 25 dollars off of your registration deposit. Thank you to Lingoda for helping me with my friend journey and let's move on with the vlog. This is like a secret garden. Look, a little stream. Oh, this is such a calming sound as well. Guys, this park. I'm a little bit in, a little bit in love. Oh, look at us, oh. lovers, lovers in Paris. <laughs> Since both me and Dimitra had been to Paris before, we really had no set agenda. Like our goal was just to wander around aimlessly, kind of go to parks and bookstores and boulangeries and just enjoy the city and kind of pretend we're living there a little bit. There we are taking a little crisp break on the bridge. We looked at the Seine and these huge touristy boats that were a little bit frightening. Finalement, nous arrivons à Musée d'Orsay. Time to claim our free under 26 ticket. <laughs> My petit, petit ami, I think is girlfriend. Allons-y. Tag yourself. I'm her. That's so me. Um, we did not anticipate this. Run, girlies. Girls are getting crepes. Bonjour. Um, j'aimerais un crepe avec Nutella. Uh, Peut-être tu as un serviette. Oui, serviette. <laughs> Okay. Wait, how do I turn it the other way around? Oh my god, I love this. I feel so powerful. Do you? I am creating a short movie about pizza. Where are you gonna go? So unbothered. Bye. <laughs> This is like an inception behind the scenes moment. Tired after an entire day of sightseeing, we just laid in Jardin du Luxembourg and journaled and talked and people watched, which is one of my favorite activities. Time just passed so slowly and I don't know, just, it's just moments like these which matter to me on trips, not necessarily doing all of it. So update time, it's 11.30. We're embarking on our hike to Sacré-Cœur, which you do have to walk all the steps to. Good morning! All of this to get to this. <laughs> wow. Truly spectacular. We started our third day by going to L'Orangerie, where you can admire the famous water lilies by Monet. They were truly breathtaking and we just took a long time staring at them. To detach myself from the background noises and focus on the art, I just listened to some classical music on my noise cancelling headphones. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I get it. Does it get more touristy than that? Boulangerie Hall. Olive and set of bread. Pain au chocolat. And how much to accompany the bread? Excited about mine. Got the same thing. We really made it just in time, to be fair. 
This is some madness. I mean, I'm really happy because it means the air is gonna cool off, but like, I low key wanna be outside and running in the rain right now. Like, that's how hot it is. Too. I'm just gonna get a latte with oat milk. Our last full day in Paris was spent sitting at cafes, trying more tasty pastries. As you can see, this one was delightful. And in the evening, we went to this cute restaurant for our only one dinner out. It was nice to eat something else than a charcuterie board. And the food was truly delectable. I ventured out by myself this morning to see Le Sacré Coeur by day. Not done yet. 